Hi guys, welcome to the Flight Ace channel. Famous British promoter Frank Warren shared his opinion about a possible fight between his world George Joyce and former world heavyweight champion Anthony Joshua. According to Warren, he has a note up that Joyce will knock out Joshua. Joe wants this fight, and why not? This is a great opportunity for him. If Joshua wants to meet with him, then you need to sit down at the negotiating table and make a decision. Before Anthony's last fight, he attracted more attention to himself, but now his stock has fallen. Joyce has a good job, so I have no doubt that he will exhaust Joshua and then knock him out. Anthony has had performances over the last few years where he looked at a little above average. Warren said. Swedish heavyweight Otto Wallian, previously included in the list of potential rivals of the star British ex-champion Anthony Joshua, commented on the news. Whether Ed Hearn owes me for disrupting the fight with Dylan White or not, I think I really deserve this fight. I am the best option, without a doubt. And this is definitely the biggest opportunity for me. There is an fighter in the division who looks more like Usyk. I am left-handed, I have a European style, we box pretty much alike. Yes, and Ortiz is left-handed, but he has a Cuban style. And besides, he didn't look very good in the fight with Charles Martin, the fighter said. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. If you really enjoy the content, then please, subscribe to my channel and keep watching the videos. If you are subscribed, then you receive notifications about the release of new videos. You do not even have to look for anything personally. I really want to get 10,000 subscribers on my channel. I'm trying very hard, absolutely every day, and I need your support. Your likes, comments, reposts to social networks. Thanks to everyone who subscribes to my channel. You are my support. Thank you so much. Former world champion Johnny Nelson doubted that the star British heavyweight Anthony Joshua now makes sense to agree to a fight with Joe Joyce. There are a lot of fighters around, but Joshua is a businessman, so he will make sure that this will be the best deal for him. Joe Joyce's name was mentioned several times. But of course, we must remember how it was with Charles Eubank and Gennady Golovkin. Their fight was talked about because it elevated two names in one sentence. A fight with Joe Joyce will not benefit Joshua. This will benefit Joyce. AJ has to think about what will be beneficial for his career. Let's wait for what he says, not us or Joe Joyce's people, Johnny Nelson said. The famous British coach Dave Caldwell named priority rivals for a compatriot Anthony Joshua, who is preparing to hold an interim performance before a rematch with Alexander Usyk. If I were a fan, I would want to see Wilder. And if it were a manager, then someone like Otwalin or Luis Ortiz. Why? He had problems with Usyk, left-handed. And I would like to see him against another lefty. Yes, you won't find a guy like Usyk, but at least you will find a lefty. If Joshua does this and then goes to Usyk, he will conduct three consecutive training sessions, which will give him an understanding of how to box, the specialist said. The British heavyweight contender Daniel Zuo spoke about a potential duel of division neighbors and compatriots Anthony Joshua and Joe Joyce. It's a good fight, really good. Joe is on the rise and he will not miss his opportunity, which will give us a great spectacle. I don't even know how to answer this question about comparing Pfizer's. Obviously, they are on the top of the division, so I have no doubt they will give the fans what they want, the fighter said. Early in the interview, Joshua said that he was not interested in a fight with Joyce, which caused his displeasure. Former heavyweight champion Anthony Joshua has made it clear that he is not interested in a fight against Joe Joyce or Otto Wallen. Shortly after Wallen's promoter Dmitry Salita announced that his word was ready to share the ring with Joshua, Joe Joyce also expressed a desire to fight with the former champion. However, Joshua made it clear that he was not interested in these challenges. Do you really think I would fight Joyce? Lol, good, I have shared the ring with most of the people you see in the heavyweight division today. I boxed with Otto Wallen twice in the youth. I fought with Joe and stopped him in the first round. I will do the same thing today, nothing has changed it, Anthony Joshua wrote. 
Swedish heavyweight Otto Warren is ready to fight Anthony Joshua if the WBA, WBO and IBF world champion Alexander Usyk is unable to rematch with the Briton. Otto is left-handed just like Usyk. The numbers don't lie and, according to statistics, Wallin delivered more punchers than any other Fury opponent, including Tyson's first fight with Wilder and a duel with Vladimir Klitschko combined. I believe that Otto has all the necessary skills confidence and based on his last fight and the experience of fights in a Britain to beat Joshua. If the fight with Usyk doesn't take place, then Wildin vs Joshua is the most intriguing fight, in the heavyweight division of course. The cancellation of the fight with White made Otto hungrier in the fight for a place at the top of the heavyweight division, Dmitry Salida said. The head of the matchroom boxing promotion company Eddie Hearn said that he continues to work on organizing an interim fight for British heavyweight Anthony Joshua. As you know, for a possible opponents were previously named. These are Dante Wilder, Joe Joyce, Luis Ortiz and Otto Wallen. Now the promoter advises his words to focus on the last two candidates, Otto Wallen and Luis Ortiz. Recently Joshua asked me, which fight is most likely? I replied, listen, you are going to fight Usyk. That's why you need to meet Lefty. Or Tizor Wallen will become his opponent. In any case, this is a good preparation for a fight with Usyk. It makes sense. If Usyk's team contacts us and says that Alexander is ready to fight in June, then we will meet with him. If they say he will be ready by October, then we will have an interim fight, Hearn said. British Olympian and heavyweight fighter Fraser Clark spoke about the potential duel of compatriots and the visual neighbors Anthony Joshua and George Joyce. Journalists asked if Joshua agrees to an interim fight before the meeting with Usyk. Can you just become him, or is it unrealistic? Clark says. It's a not going to happen. Yes, it's a good fight and Frank Warren should try to organize it, but nothing will work. To be honest, Joshua got into a difficult situation. Clark said. Carl Freud, the former world champion, said he wants to see a Joyce at the next opponent of the star British heavyweight Anthony Joshua. I want to see a fight with Joshua. It's a great fight. Joshua said he would uh, knock him out in one round. No, he won't do that. It's a great fight, but it won't knock Joyce out in the first round. No one can knock out Joyce in one round. I don't think anyone is capable of knocking him out completely, even if they have a sledgehammer in their gloves. The choice is solid, this is a serious fight for anyone. This is a duel that I would like to see. Strictly speaking, this is a fight that needs to be promoted. Luis Ortiz has passed his peak. He is a little old. Ortiz is a great fighter and he will cause Joshua problems. But let him fight the Joyce. Give Joyce a fight. Look, I wouldn't fight a Joyce because it's a dangerous fight in which you can lose, Froch said. Carl Froch also believes that Anthony Joshua should not fight with Dante Wilder, who is the pool of potential opponent of the British heavyweight. I like Luis Ortiz, but I'm not sure about Otto Allen. The fight with Dante Wilder is a great fight. That would be exciting. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel.